hit hard by injuries, a patched up Carlisle gave Charlton a three goal start, then nearly pulled off a stunning comeback only to suffer late heartbreak. Johnny Jackson put the Addicts in front midway through the first half. There's an unwritten rule in football that when a player goes back to his former club, he scores. It's not always true, but it was in this one. Joe Anienza returning to Brunton Park and making it 2 0 to his current side. And when Paul Benson made it three within a couple of minutes of the restart, Charlton looked a dead cert to register only their second away league win of the season. But the walking wounded didn't roll over. Mike Greller on loan from Leeds put the Cumbrians on the board just before the hour. The American scoring on his first start for the club. Charlton thumped 4-0 by Brighton last week suddenly looked nervous. And just three minutes later, Carlisle exploited that edginess to the full. Not much defending going on and eventually almost a free header for Craig Curran. And Carlisle with lots of time to continue the turnaround. With 13 minutes left, they were level. Tom Taywo's cross bamboozled everyone, but Gary Medine did just enough to stab the ball past visiting keeper Rob Elliott. And there was no need of video technology to prove that the ball had crossed the line. But then, in added time, Benson struck the killer blow with a powerful header. And no time for Carlisle to get back into it. Charlton had pinched it at the death. 